Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody kept asking me some questions and I got them to email me a file. They wanted a bit of closed curves. He, he actually said kind of different, uh, the opposite of the virtual segment delete key that would delete these lines. He wanted to know, he even showed me a path that he wanted to do. So I'm just gonna take these halfway black circles and just move them out of the way because I don't even know how he, these paths are non-touchable and I don't even think they're locked. So I don't know what's going on there, but he wanted to finish these, connect these paths without connecting the two circles. I don't know exactly why. And you could do this with or without the, the shape tool, but we, you select it, you go there and you get both ends. And I kind of measured what this circle is with the parallel dimension tool, trying to get a ballpark, it's four, hundred, uh, four and a half inches big. So if we, let's zoom in here. If we take the shape tool and select on that and we could select those two, doesn't really, I don't even think we have to, I think we could have done it with the pick tool. But we go to Windows, Dockers, and Join Curves. It's gonna show you right there. I made my gap tolerance four and a half inches because it's not quite that, but it's make sure, and it, I don't think it matters what the radius is because it's gonna, if you use the fillet, it's gonna do that. Now this time, let's just use the pick tool and see if it won't close the curve, and it does. So it, it knows that there's an open point and just to let him know that these are now circles and they're not connected. I don't really understand why you would do that, but, uh, or there, there might be another situation, but I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.